Today I'm going to show you a way of checking the price of items on Amazon. I'm filming this just before Black Friday and there's been a lot of news reports that some deals that you might find on Amazon are not as good as you think. So to get started you need to sign up to a website that I've been using for a long time, camelcamelcamel.com. I'll leave a link in the description and comments below. This is a free website and it's a free service and you get started by installing one of the browser extensions. So they've got browser extensions for all the main browsers. Get that installed and you'll get this little camel book at the top. When you're taking a look at a product you're interested in buying and you see the price, then all you have to do is click this little icon up here. So this is an item I was actually looking to purchase. It's something that I can use to film my product reviews. So I press the little camel and as you can see, it goes back and if it's got the data, it'll show you the price over time. Now this is important because you can see right now would be a terrible time to buy it because only a couple of months ago it was right down here, it was under £60 whereas now it's almost £100. If the price is too high for you at the moment, especially if it's a new product, it probably won't have had a price reduction, you can come down to this section and add a price watch. And what this will do is it will keep an eye on the price and when it now drops below the £60 it will email me and let me know that it's ready for me to buy. This doesn't work on all products so here's another example. If I just click on this it will try and load the data but there's not enough there to be able to return the graph. So that doesn't tend to work on smaller items but right now the GoPro Hero 10 has only recently come out so I'm going to take a look at that and see what it can do and you can see it started off the highest price it's been is $479.99 and so right now is the lowest price I could buy the Hero 10 for. If that wasn't low enough, if I wanted to wait six months, another year, something like that, I could go ahead and select a standard price drop or I could put my own price in. So you could either just say 15% or you might say, well, actually, I'd be okay with it, 370 As you build up your watch list, if you go over to the Camel 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 site, you can see a range of products. So I've just thrown all these on and you can see it's been tracking them and you've got the desired price and it'll tell me that it's not near the desired price yet. So there you go, don't be caught out this Black Friday. Make sure to use these tools to help get the best deal possible and don't be pressured into buying something if you don't need it. Hope you found this useful. Thanks for watching.